I need to explain you the basics about drawing shadows. I cannot go here just like in this one and start doing the shadows. I need you to understand clearly how our mind connects with our propose on drawing, how we create that propose and how we apply it into the canvas. To understand what you want with your picture, you can go two, two ways. First, you can pretty much do what I did my whole life, go in the internet and see what others are doing. The best when you're going to search for this is going to be a dude in the gym doing this pose with light coming from above to show the muscles even stronger or a dude in the beach because he's in a trip, in a vacation. He's just relaxing with a paradise scene at behind. So we gotta understand what is the normal, what is considered the basic thing that we would find depending on the pose that our character is doing. Let's see what is the pose, what he's doing and what would be the best for it. This character right here is showing how strong he is and it's happy. So the two examples that I gave it, about it can go extra well on it can go extra extra well so now that we understand oh this mood this expression this posture goes well with mm, where he would be doing that in the gym showing how strong he is to a friend or posting that somewhere now we understand what kind of mood we would be doing we ask ourselves mm, why would be doing this pose in the gym if you are a gym fanatic just like me <laughs> You would know they always get the light coming from above to show the muscles even bigger. It's strong shadows, it's strong contrast. And that's how we made a connection between our mind, the purpose and the drawing, okay? We always ask ourselves, what is happening here? Where this would be happening in a story in real life? We try to find the context. So now I'm going to pick photos of Jim, Jim dudes. This one would be reference for muscles and this one would be reference for light coming from above. I'm going to use this one mainly. What I'm seeing here are not those crazy muscle fibers, are not the vasculatory. I'm seeing these huge tones of shadows happening here, okay? These huge shadows is what I'm looking at, okay? Do you see this area full of shadows, this area full of shadows, this area full of shadows? This is what I'm looking here. You gotta separate the details from the thing that you really want. Okay, now after that we have objective and a reference, we can go. Now we start adding shadows. Multiply, multiply. Now we can start adding shadows. Shadow colossus. He's burning his green, but I'm still going to add warm tones into the shadows. I'm going to already go all out on hey you get painted you you get painted heck yeah you yeah you you get painted you get strongly painted This ear is just chew up to cast a shadow. Okay, that's all. Now we can work more in these shadows. We just did a simple base. We did not make anything like extra, extra perfect. Now we start lowering our opacity. Now we start going a little bit. into soft area not only soft using lasso to to really determine what is what what is love and what is not love like here this area i'm going to select a darker color darker here 
It's going to be much darker. You can see this man armpit, how dark it is. We're gonna make the same. I'm going already with black, okay? But be careful to not go crazy strong on it. Now let's select this other area here. The best way to do this, I would recommend, would be using color burn. But we are doing everything on multiply, so that's it, folks. Look at something that we can notice. This, this chest is smaller it's smaller and i believe it's because biceps is some way compressing it so biceps should be even more here it should be even closer like hey bro i want to sniff your i mean even happier even happier oh okay please don't do this don't do this don't do this because of muscles, we don't see all of them perfectly like this. We see them like this. Some we see well, some we don't. Some just appear, some just disappear. It's a crazy thing. I'm going in place of doing on a new layer. I'm going to change my brush mode, okay? I'm going to use the color burn that I want to choose. I want, I'm going to burn the colors that I wanted to burn. I was feeling that inside of me, that necessity of burning stuff. Now I can finally appreciate how it is to burn things. And not only that, I'm going to press Ctrl, Shift, X, yes. And I'm going to make this chest bigger. This chest. Yeah, this, this chest. The most intense shadow here is not in the lower area of the chest, but here in the middle. Here there is reflection from its own skin. Here there is reflection from its own skin. So the lower area that you're doing here is going to be brighter. Did you guys ever thought about it? When you're doing nipples, let, let me show a simple way to do nipples. Forget they are circles. Think of them as triangles. Triangle gap, why? Let me show you right now why. Why gaps? Do, do a little... Duh, okay, and then you forget it and then close to it, do another one, but go getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Okay. One space, another one, and then start getting bigger, bigger, bigger. And now you do the same by the side, okay? Here, and then start getting bigger, 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 bigger. And now here you do the same, bigger, 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 bigger. There's a nipple. This is a simple way to do it. One if it was bigger than the other, do you know what you do? Make one smaller. Here are the lats, okay? This this area here, there is no things like this. This this is the lats. The lats you used to do pull-ups. I want to get my lats bigger. Do you want to get your lats bigger? Get your lats bigger. separating and then uh, now you can do this area here rib cage okay rib cage touching abs i see those mu those muscles are a little bit just a little bit inflated so let's keep them inflated why not this area here darker Oh, by the way, in the reflection, you make it even more saturated. People just love it. Look at this. Look, look at this. Look at this in here. Little line saturated. Little line saturated. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.
we're in the middle here. Think of the fur movement, don't think far by far. Think of the fur movement, okay? And of course, you can do some muscle bending points here. This TT needs to be even more squished. I'm going to make this biceps extra squishy. Remember guys, I'm looking at reference. I'm not taking all of this from my head. Do you think I would be taking all of this from my head? No freaking way. Remember that. Monitor contrast. Okay, only huge contrast on a specific places like armpits. Okay, armpits. A little line here be below the chest. The belly bottom. Okay. These are the only places that are gonna be extra dark. Only. The rest. We take it to the ranch. And we make it shine bright. Or just a little bit of shadows. Never too much. How much blend? The blending is always going to focus on the shadows. The sh direction of the shadow. If it's a strong casted shadow like this one, or if it's just a soft one like here in the biceps. Here, I would not go all the way making everything darker because I need to remember myself. Only the armpits and close to chest is extra dark, not the other place. It's gonna be only if here just a little bit could make extra dark, but all the rest gonna be bright. All the rest. All, 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 all the rest. Okay, just, just basic shadow. I didn't make anything here cray cray. Just basic, basic shadow around the greens. Let's do some veins. make everything smooth okay smooth you smooth thigh you just make everything extra smooth again light coming from above i'm gonna change here into color dodge just make some light coming from above to show people hey did you know lights coming from above small merch time just saying like hey if you want to learn art with me and get this stream save it because none of my streams get saved it i'm just saying that you can get it with my all in pack 50 percent discount okay just saying just saying you click here and you go into game road page go it's going to take you into game road game road that's right and you apply the code gbt50 and do you know what you get discount that's right discount 